Hello, welcome to this uh, video tutorial. I have started this uh, first video tutorial on on this new series on uh, hardware programming. It's also known as embedded or system programming mm, using Modbus. Modbus is a protocol. TCP based protocol used by many devices nowadays, industrial devices nowadays to communicate among them and uh, throughout uh, my experience along with on different projects I have used certain libraries with different languages and today I'm going to share with you those libraries that can help you to easily get started and develop uh, some industrial ready and professional applications what are those libraries they are drawback advantages the first one is jmod jmod is um, a mod boost implementation in 100% Java base so if you are a Java programmer and uh, you would like to make some hardware programming suppose you want to control uh, a hardware like uh, a PLC or any industrial uh, devices that use mod boost so or you can uh, do that one with uh, jmod as you can read it use uh, it is used to implement modbus master and slave in various flavors like using tcp cl or ip tcp cl or ip and blah 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 uh, the next one is uh, n modbus n modbus is my preferred one it's very popular with good and latest documentations and this is based on C sharp and supporting RGU and UDP TCP based protocols and I really find it very smooth working out of the box <coughs> so if you are a C sharp or .NET developer this one can be a good library the last one is um, OSCAT OSCAT is one of the libraries very common if you are a PLC developer and it's developed according to this protocol IEC 6113 and uh, it is based on structured text and the difference between this library and the first one is that this one is running within the PLC so you would not run as a normal computer as a normal program on a computer you have you need to use this special uh, devices called plc and uh, structure text here oscar library is based on that one so i have done some project with that and it was pretty cool using codices ide and uh, it was just wonderful and I also like to, I would like to share with you some of the websites. This is the website of uh, Jmod, Jmod library. So you can see here, with everything is here with a pretty good uh, documentations and some explanations and even uh, some good snippets. You have everything here, even some good snippets how to get started. The next one is um, this uh, nmodbus here. You can see the git up here with uh, yeah recent update just few months ago and it's regularly updated and you can also uh, if you are using uh, Visual Studio you can also install it directly using 
your package manager and install it. Yeah. Install it directly under your project using the following commands. And Oscar Library is the website of the Oscar Library, but um, I don't know if the good news or the bad news is that is the documentation is much more regular in is in German. They are pretty good translation. They are trying to translate stuff in English. Even when I was using that one, I had only a basic German knowledge. It was not really a big problem because I translate everything. Yeah. And uh, I really find, uh, find it very helpful. As you can see here with this one, I could I uh, could perform perform this communication between client and server and even send some file on STP and many things file manipulation everything was just awesome yeah doing this thing so here you can see different version down there yeah and a very good forums here and community and uh, yeah things here it was just helpful a very good forum and community behind that one uh, so I hope that uh, this uh, there are some other libraries out there but these are the three that I really use them and uh, in the next days I will try also to show some small snippets some small projects some small code that are running and yeah thank you for watching and uh, see you in the next video tutorial and i hope that it has been helpful to you and if you have used any other libraries or anything that you liked you think that can be helpful you can please do not hesitate to share it with us as a comment drop your comments thank you and say bye